From News 19, I'm meteorologist Daniel Bonds here. All the hurricane tracks for the 2024 season. It's been a very busy season so far. Our last name storm was Ernesto. It's been relatively quiet since Ernesto. Watching this area, Hurricane Center gives it only a small chance of further development over the next seven days. As we do move through the rest of the month and into September, heading into the peak of the season. So we do expect more tropical development. Back here at home, football season continues. This would be week one. Last week was week zero. Temperatures at kickoff probably in the mid to upper 80s. There will be a small opportunity for a pop-up shower or thunderstorm Friday afternoon. If you're heading over to Williams Price Stadium on Saturday, it's going to be hot. It's going to be humid. There'll be a small chance for a little bit of rain with kickoff temperatures probably in the lower 90s. Right now we're going for a kickoff temperature of 93 degrees, which would put it in the top not the top, but in the top hottest kickoff home temperatures on record. Notice the top here was 94 degrees, Texas A&M back in 2014 and Alabama in 2005. So possibly one of the hottest football games we've had on record at williams Bryce Stadium. Some showers and thunderstorms will be possible today. Hot, humid otherwise, so drink plenty of water. And if you're going to be doing anything outdoors, keep in mind those allergy sufferers are having a little bit of an issue out there. So you may be suffering from some seasonal allergies with grasses and ragweed causing the main problems. Sunset 753 this evening. You notice we'll continue to lose just a little bit of daylight towards the end of the day there. 743 next week and then three weeks from today 724. Yesterday we did manage to make it up to 97 degrees. No rain officially at the Columbia Metropolitan Airport, but we had a few stray showers. Haven't had any measurable rainfall in Columbia since Saturday the 17th. Can't rule out a pop-up shower or thunderstorm today. Notice our forecast model showing that chance for a little bit of rain. Once we lose the heating of the day, the chances for rain will start to decrease. Then as we look ahead towards tonight, partly cloudy skies. Fog will be possible Friday morning, Friday afternoon during the hot part of the day. Isolated shower, storm can't be ruled out. And this will be basically the same pattern as we go into Saturday as well. So for today, high temperatures in the mid to maybe upper 90s. Heat index values will make it feel a little bit hotter. And there will be that chance for a few showers and thunderstorms, otherwise just hot and humid. Heat index values in the low 100 degree range will be about 102 tomorrow. It does improve a little bit on Saturday as our air temperatures drop a little bit on Saturday as well. Better chances of rain Monday, especially Tuesday and Wednesday. High temperatures dropping down into the upper 70s to near 80 degrees, so it will be a little bit cooler. Myrtle Beach forecast looking pretty good over the weekend with only a small chance for a pop-up shower or storm on Saturday. It looks basically dry along the low country and in Charleston with high temperatures in the upper 80s to near 90 degrees. Greenville, there'll be a chance for some afternoon showers and storms on Sunday. Saturday should be pretty dry. Here's our 8 to 14 day rainfall outlook showing opportunity for wetter than normal conditions. And during that same time frame, as of right now, we're looking for cooler than normal conditions. That would be September 5th through September 11th. College football, we just talked about it a little bit, only two days away. Labor Day is next Monday. Fall equinox is three weeks and three days from today. And you can follow me on these social media outlets. Have a great Thursday.